what's up y'all it's your girl tay back with another video so um basically i enjoyed our mind in today's video today i want to start on a positive note with this video the video is cute we saw our mom meet nay's grandma probably for like the first time you know <laughs> um but she said i'll be telling nay to bring you over there i'm telling you nay gotta oh look grandma can cook too grandma nita can cook mama nita can cook she crazy like she crazy but she funny y'all like i'm like yo nay go ahead take him over there you know what i'm saying like that's the vibe right there i'm glad they are having a great time out in cabo um i thought this could be a trip to just enjoy themselves because you know they really deserve it and some things just don't go like that like for real for real for real we was doing so good no drama but every month there is something with the same person like i said i'm a very positive person but i'm gonna bring it up and yeah it's my opinions at the end of the day i don't want to judge anyone because we are all non-perfect people we have our imperfections but at the end of the day, some things we bring on ourselves, whether or not we would like to admit it. Basically, the shade room has now the shade room teams has now posted. Um, as we know, Armand's ex Essie had penned a tweet. I might post it, I might not, because I'm pretty sure it's made its rounds. We've all seen it. Well, she had pinned a comment under her photo on Instagram. We all saw it, and it was like, "Yo, Armand and fame and money done switched him, and he he done changed up." He done left his family. It was around that line. I don't have a comment in front of me. But I just want to say, first, to start off, Armand did not leave his family. And I say that because to leave, if you look in the dictionary, because we got to be so specific, like yesterday when Nay, oh my bad, she didn't catch the bouquet when she picked it up. It was She didn't catch it. She didn't catch it. I'm like... It wasn't even y'all. It was just like, the, once again, you know, constantly on the shade room, constantly on the shade room teens. She didn't catch it. She did not catch it. I'm like, all right, bro. Y'all want to be so specific. I looked up the definition of, you know, to leave, left. And it means, let me make sure I got this right. Leave, go away from. Armand did not leave anything, okay? Armand might have, uh, Armand and Essie aren't pretty sure they came to a decision together to just co-parent their child. But the person who left the family, if you want me to be real honest with you, was Essie. Armand stayed. Essie left. She went all the way to California and she took their, keyword being their daughter, um, with her. So, therefore, he did not leave anything. So, we can, if we can just be real specific, if we want to be real specific and talk on it, he didn't leave anything. We got to stop saying he left. He didn't leave nothing. Just saying. He might have left that relationship, but he didn't leave his family. Let's get that right right now. His family is his daughter. Just saying. That's his family. Um, But basically, I'm going to say it like this. Like I said, I'm not trying to like speak on the topic too much. Essie penned a comment. She know what the comment said, right? So you know what that comment said. You pinning it. No matter if you how long you had it pinned, you saw it, you pinned it. And now it's a big controversial topic. I understand you're still self-healing and it takes time. I understand y'all, you went through something. But my thing is you cannot pin a comment like that and expect for people to just, and then try to cover it up as in people always constantly trying to bash me and make fun of my character. And it's like, no, we're not. You're giving us a reason. Just like last time when it came to, um, oh, that's the rain, okay. When it came to Essie and her sister, you let someone call your child's father a deadbeat. Like, you let your sister call your child's father a deadbeat. That's where the beef was. Now the beef again. You pin in a comment that says fame and money changed our mind and how he left his family. Like, you saw the comment. I don't know why you would post something like that, in my opinion. You know what I'm saying? This girl got played so good, shaking my head. Our mind, money, and fame got you to switch up, and family was not strong enough for you to stay shaking my head. I, I really don't. You, you pinned a comment, honey. You didn't like it, my bad. You might have liked it too, but you pinned a comment under your post that said something like that. It's going to garnish attention. like. But for you to play it like you didn't do anything is what gets me. Like, I, I mean, you at some point do got to take your time and be like, dang, this is maybe how it did look. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. 
<laughs> it's like, why are you playing innocent, basically? Like, why are you playing like you didn't pin the comment? Like, that's what's really getting me. She's playing like she did not pin the comment. I mean, like I said, I have no hate at all towards Essie. It's just, why are you playing victim every time something happens? And you got to sometimes understand, oh, wait, this is how I did look. I swear, you probably don't look at how anybody... You probably look at everybody like, oh, they're a bad person, they're a bad person. But you don't consider yourself a bad person. You may be not a bad person, but you were in the wrong for the situation. And I don't know what to say, y'all. Like, I'm just blown away how she went to Twitter so innocent. Like, she didn't just pin that. Com it's different. I would rather you have said something about those actions. Like, wait, I did pin this comment. This is how this came off. But as you just keep proving people's points, like, just... You know, get off social media, honey. Um, Maybe she needs, I mean, like, a real self-healing trip. I mean, she takes herself out of the country. Go, you know, like, a, I don't mean, no, go hang with your friends. No, because if you have those friends that baby you, oh, my God, Essie, how are you? What's, you know, like, talk to us. You don't need that. You need to go self-heal out of the country, like I'm telling. Or just go out of state and really, like, you know, go to somewhere where you can just be in a hotel, not in mommy mode, okay? Like, I know you want to be a mother to your child, but you, if you want to be the best mother, you want to be the best you for your child, even that's, like, I'm like, okay, y'all always talking about Armand's not with his child that much, or my bad, not y'all, but haters, Armand's not with his child that much, he don't see her like that, but I bet when she does come around, he's the best him he can be, because the people that are around him, and he's allowed himself that time to regroup, reset, that's what Essie need to do, I'm saying, like, right now, if you want to be the best mother for your child, I'm not saying you're not the best mother already for your child, but mentally, you deserve to... And okay, even if you're already the best mother for your child. Mentally, you should be wanting to be better, okay, for yourself. Go take that trip. Okay, you have family that can watch your child. You have a whole father who if you're like, I just need a mental break to reset. He would not mind coming to pick up his child and take care of his child. Because at the end of the day, that is his child and he knows that. Like, you know what I'm saying? All I'm saying is she needs a mental break. Because mentally, like, I'm nobody's trying to destroy you. I promise you, you probably think the whole world is against you. We just trying to, like, we can't help you heal. That's your journey. We can't tell you what path to take. But we can at least show you how you coming off. Because that's what you keep missing. You keep thinking you're so innocent. And that's how you keep coming off. But I swear, like, I'm a real positive person. I don't mean to be, if this coming off is negative, I'm sorry. But at the end of the day, like, come on, girl. Like, what more do you want? <laughs> we trying here. You know, I'm really trying to be all, like. It's okay, she'll get it. You know, maybe she just needs some more time. But it's like, baby, go on. Like, all right, y'all, I'm done. Cause, uh, but I hope y'all did enjoy his vlog. If you haven't, go tune into that. Prayers for everyone in that situation. Because it really shouldn't even be a situation. But prayers for everybody involved in that little, you know, mix. And I hope y'all enjoy the rest of y'all week. Deuces.